Good morning. It's Tuesday Inspiration with Toby. I'm sure that everyone is doing good today. I'm sure that you're living your best life. I'm sure that you're trying to be the best version of yourself. You know, today's topic is connotation. Connotation. Meaning that what meaning are you giving to your life? Everyone wants to live the life of affluence. Everyone wants to live that life of, okay, I am this, I am that. I can achieve A, B, C. I'm involved in this. I have the skills. I have these potentials. Um, I can do um, everything that comes to my mind. Yes, everyone must look at these ways and, you know, keep living your best life. You have to take it seriously. Um, you need to understand that it is necessary to have the right connotation about your life if you check your life every time every moment what connotation is your life giving you are you just living your life without um understanding where you're headed are you just living your life like oh I, i'm just living my life I, I don't know where i'm going to be in the next two seconds but man i don't care i, I could just live my life you know that's not what you're supposed to do you're not supposed to just take and take things for granted and think that oh yeah you can just afford to live your life the way you want it and um, do whatever you want to do you know it's your life yes it's your life but if your life is not making a meaning if your life is not getting um, the desired thing you're supposed to get if you're not getting to that place of success or um, that place of achievement that you uh, have envisioned you definitely will have to think again you definitely have to look at your life at every point in time and you have to see yourself moving towards the right direction uh, for every minute you waste on living a fake life you actually waste your time not learning what you're supposed to learn for every minute you waste living a fake life telling people this is what you are and you're not you begin to waste your time you know instead of you to learn how to do things that learn a, a craft learn um or sharpen your skills you begin to live your life just um because you want people to um associate themselves with you and all people yes would have to associate themselves with you like for example if you're on um instagram and people seeing your pictures they're seeing oh this person has these cars and what have you they begin to like you oh they like your pictures or they begin to say ah this guy's wealthy this guy's there this guy's brilliant this guy's a b c d but the truth is, is that the right connotation? Is that who you are? Are you the owner of all these things that you're talking about? That your skill, how is it relevant to whatever you're doing? The moment people start to notice you physically now, off the gram, that, okay, yes, you're not um, that person you said you are, they begin to distance themselves from you and you begin to see that um, you're not achieving that great thing um, you want to achieve because of the fake life because you're not having the right connotation to your life now if you have all of the degrees in this world if you have all of the skills in this world if you have all of the potentials in this world and you're not fully utilizing them you're not putting them into use you definitely would um have to just think again because if you don't use or put into um, good utilization all of these skills and potentials that you've got, you will just see that relevance will be far from you. You will not be relevant. I preach relevance every time. I talk to people on um, different platforms and all I want to say is to uh, is for everybody to um, be relevant in their little corners. You have to ensure that you're being relevant. This one is from um, Rick Riordan. Rick Riordan said, if my life is going to mean anything, I have to leave it myself. If your life is going to mean anything, you have to leave it yourself. You have to ensure that you own all that belongs to you. You own it. You um, see that, yes, this is my life. These are the things I want to achieve. This is how I, I'm going to achieve it. I'm not going to live my life in a way that people will begin to see that, um, yes, it's not... Um, this is this is a fake life this is not who he is he just tells us and uh, this is what he does but he doesn't do it now come on if you're not a lawyer and you're probably going to wear um a, a lawyer's attire to say you want to stand for somebody in the court you'd see that once they discover that you're fake you get apprehended you get arrested and people begin to look at you like oh yeah this man, why did he do this? Why did you do that? So why must you live a fake life? Why must you pretend to be what you're not? You have to ensure that if you are something, you um, are probably 
that thing. If you're not that thing, just live true to yourself. Be true to yourself. Let everybody know who you are. Let people know that, okay, yes, this is what I stand for. This is how I want to achieve A. This is how I want to achieve B. You have to choose your patterns. You have to choose your pathways wisely. Then um, you have to try to invest in yourself. Investing in oneself is very important. It's very paramount that you invest in yourself. You tell yourself that, okay, yes, I want to achieve this. How then do you achieve this if you are not investing in yourself? Please invest in yourself right from this time and have the right connotations about your life. Let your life make a meaning. Let your life make a meaning. Let it be sensible. Let your life make an impact to those around you yes in the journey of self-discovery it is important that you discover yourself first before you begin to transfer um, the knowledge you have acquired over the years but it is also important for you to know that while you're also acquiring this knowledge you can also start to transfer the little ones you know the little things you know uh, you transfer you uh, that if you transfer you would um, definitely be getting better you definitely would make it in life but you have to live rightly. You have to ensure that you're making um, the, 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 the good things of life that comes to you, the best things that will bring out your skills and potential. Don't forget what um, Rick Riordan said. If my life is going to mean anything, I have to live it myself. It is your life. It is yours. It is not my life. You can't live my life. I can't live your life. So we definitely have to live our life separately and ensure that we're making a meaning in all our um, places of work, in wherever, amongst our friends and all. Let people know you for something. Let your life have, have um, the right connect, connotation. And you see that um, you would be somebody who would achieve tremendous success. If you achieve tremendous success, it is going to be to your credit. It is not going to be to my credit. For example, if people say that um, um, I know Femi or Tedola, I know Dangote, I know Tony Elumelu. It is because these people have been true to themselves and their lives have been making the right connotations. They see them as businessmen, business tycoons, business gurus, and that is exactly what they are. They don't tell you that they are something else. Even in their personal lives, I don't know them personally, but I want to believe that people know them and say, oh, of course, you've seen them celebrate and people are like, oh, this is who Tony Elimolu is, this is who Femi Atadula is, this is who Dangote is. You definitely have to do away with fake life and begin to live your life to the best version that you want to see. Upgrade yourself by having the right connotation. It's Tuesday Inspiration with Toby. Thank you for joining me for this inspiring session. I hope to inspire you every day. I hope to... Um, connect with you in the future please live your best life and have the right connotations you can read up all of these articles um all my articles on my social media platforms and um, keep sharing my videos and keep reposting thank you very much have the right connotation about your life let your life have the right connotation i'll see you next week tuesday thank you very much for joining me bye <laughs>